With more and more of our personal information being tracked and stored online, cybersecurity is more important than ever. And it's not just the experts who need to know their stuff. Our Jessica Taylor shares how Boise State is making cybersecurity know-how more accessible for all. We are now graduating 100 computer scientists, where in 2012 we were graduating 25. And so that is certainly a way to meet some of that workforce. Boise State has a new certificate program starting up in the fall, which aims to increase cybersecurity awareness for any student studying any major, so everyone can be more prepared in the future. Think about all the small businesses that we have across the valley. What we want the student to think about is if you are the business owner, what kind of security or information security program that you should have in place to protect your own data and also the customer's data. Governor Little wants to see the public universities collaborating on the cybersecurity front, recommending one million for joint programs between Boise State, University of Idaho, and Idaho State University. This increased level of collaboration across Idaho's higher education institutions will offer Idahoans a path to earn a degree in a high demand profession by partnering with Idaho employers, including the Idaho National Laboratory. The three universities all have relatively new presidents. The school board has started a leadership council of those presidents and gives them an opportunity to really talk together and work out things versus trying to compete with each other across the state. No legislation has been passed yet, but Boise State continues to expand its programs and prepare students. We have 22,000 students and if, if what we do will work for our campus, I believe it will work for a lot of campuses. Jessica Taylor, six on your side. The university's engineering deans have already been discussing how they would potentially share coursework and lab facilities if Governor Little's recommendation comes together.